What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome to a new Football Manager series. After I got unceremoniously sacked from Southampton, I feel like it was completely unjust. I did nothing but good things for that club. And I asked in the comment section, who should I take over next, guys? Uh, what should I do next? And um, there was mixed mixed bag, but most people suggested to take on a really big team to get used to the game and, and so on and so forth. And, and I had fun managing Arsenal anyway. And a lot of people did suggest managing Arsenal. So I thought, you know what? Let me take on Arsenal. So uh, we're going to do Arsenal today. Um, the full game is officially released today as well. So uh, that means the editor is available, which means my the, the series that I want to do, that, that I kind of plan to do for the whole year, God forbid I don't get sacked, um, that will be coming up in the next couple of days as well. So I'm either going to be uploading both daily or alternating every other day between my Arsenal save and my Real London save, which will be me creating a brand new team, putting it in, not necessarily the English divisions, but in the lowest division in one specific league, and trying to become the best uh, the best in the world with that club. So, might take it to, again, a, a league or a nation that's not necessarily full of incredible clubs and incredible players, just so um, I can have a real good chance with it. But for now, guys, Arsenal is where it's at. Uh, this is what we're doing. We're going to go through today the main um, the main stuff, get through a couple of friendlies and see who we can pick up and uh, and sign. So we've got the private messages. Um, we'll attend the meeting. Um, right, let's get this meeting done. Uh, uh, basically, just not even any point reading half this crap because uh, it's, it's all the same. Every time I've started a new game, it's exactly the same. Um, so I just like to... Um, yeah, we'll meet the journalists. Okay, thanks. Right, um, right, yeah, let's, uh, I don't need that. Um, okay, I wouldn't share, I want to, mm, no thanks, I don't need that. Would you like me to arrange a meeting with the rest of your staff? Yes, I can provide you with regular port reports, fortnightly is okay. Right, this is where I need, this. so with the agent offers, um, please don't filter out any offers, that's okay. Uh, friendlies, I want him to take care of friendlies, um, because you guys told me that taking care of friendlies is, is kind of irrelevant. Um, opposition instructions, I want him to do. Um, and then for assist with press conferences, I want to do them. Although I will send him to most because sometimes I, I really don't like them. Um, I will I will do some of them. Um, would you like me to help you with any tasks at the club? Uh, yeah, right, youth teams. Um, right, I want him to take care of those. Uh, it's okay, he, he can do what the best tactics are. Assist with team talks, I will do. Um, assist with training. Now, you guys, again, recommend that I should take care of training. Um, but I don't want to do training because I'm terrible at training. I remember as well in the Southampton one, I only clicked on general training um, for the areas I'd like to help with. Because I thought that would cover everything because it's general, but it doesn't. It's all training and match preparation, which is what I want to click on, so that they take care of everything. Um, so uh, I will eventually take care of training more and more as uh, as the, my career goes on. I will start taking things uh, um, as we go. But right now, um, yeah, I'm, I'm not really uh, not really bothered. Right, uh, I think we can qualify for the Champions League. Three people are unhappy. Fuck y'all. Fuck y'all. Um, right, there we go. Some people were unhappy. Some people... Look at Laurent Koscielny, man. He's so happy right now. Abu Dhabi. He went from unhappy... He went from abysmal to just, uh, to just unhappy or poor. So, uh, you know, progress. I like, I like progress. Here we go. Right. Um... I'll take care of tactics in a second. I'll take care of that. I'll take care of that. And I'll take care of that. So, um, the squad we have, of course, we've got some injuries. Um, who's the biggest injury down here in... Oh, no one. We've got Zell LM as well. He has got so much potential. Look at that. 17 years old. His stats are crazy good for a 17-year-old. Um, but, yeah. So, we've got in the main squad, guys... Um, there's a lot of obviously a lot of players here. There's a lot of players. I don't really need anyone. However, in my last game, I signed Gaitan, and he was phenomenal. Um, so I want to get him back again. Uh, I want to go to transfer, um, add to shortlist, and that basically that's all I have to do for the the board to try and buy Gaitan. Um, we're gonna go into scouting anyway. 
and I want him to find me. Uh, apologies for the phone. Um, I want him to find me a first team player as a uh, as a striker. I want a brand new striker because. Apologies for the noise. What the fuck is going on? Every time I start to record, something goes wrong. Uh, yeah, so we'll take uh, we'll take a, a new striker because we are low on the the striker the striker sections there. So I want the current ability, uh, potential ability at five star, um, and yeah, that that's that's pretty much it. We'll just go we'll go like that. So um, we'll wait for the stuff to come through here. We'll look at tactics. Um, so once again, I, I'm going to go back to the tactic that I've used a lot. Um, and that is basically what we have here, the the four three three DM wide. However, with that being said, I like to have the midfielders like this. So it's almost like a four five one because that is what I was playing with before. Um, and uh, in terms of picking the team, I'm not going to do that just yet. We're going to just skip through. We've got a friendly in a few days. This is more just a, a kind of getting into the getting into the game kind of video. You know, starting everything up. Uh, let's auto select those. Um, Everton Ribeiro, he looks pretty decent, but he's not really my cup of tea. I don't need wingers. I, li I genuinely don't need wingers. I have an abundance of wingers, and trying to sign um, Gaetan is is going to do even more that more than that as well. Um, um, new managers offers upheaval. Uh, I'm very impressed. Yeah, I won't be making any changes really. Your arrival at the club as Ar Arsene Wenger departs. Do you feel the expectation of replacing one of the most managers? Um, this is just—I always answer the same same stuff here. No matter who it is, what club I'm at, what kind of management experience I have. Um, that I will be going for the league. On the off chance that any agents read your comments today. Uh, I'm I'm quite happy with my squad. So, like I said, we're not going to be taking control of friendlies. Match preparation um, is no problem. Financial fair play regulations is no problem. I do want to get some players under my belt. Um, Gaitan would be one that would be nice. Um, I don't know if uh, um, I don't know if they actually just go and bid for Gaitan or or if I have to put in a bid. Before, what used to happen is I used to just put them on the shortlist, and the the board of director would just buy them or try and try and buy them. Um, let's declare my interest in him. For uh, you've reportedly made it clear that you're interested in signing left winger Nicolas Gaetan. Can you shed any more light on this? This is definitely some interest from our side. Can we do a deal? It's too soon to say. So we have got a fr first friendly here, guys, against Atlas. So like I said. We are not taking control of this uh, this friendly. Let's have a look at um, what the result was, though. Oh, damn, Norwich picking up a big 8-0 win there. Come on, where are we? Where are we? There we are. 2-1, um, only 2-1. So Santi Cazorla with both goals. He is fantastic as well. He is so good. Um, and we've got Feyenoord in about a week's time. Um, we'll go through and we will... Uh, um, Oh wow, Gaitan, uh, he said he'll pay more attention when an official bid is made. So let's put an official bid in. Uh, like I said before, the the guys used to do this for me. Um, so let's, uh, wait, 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 let's cancel. Let's, um, let's see how much they wanna want to want for him. Um, make inquiry. There we go. Um, so we'll see how much he's uh, they, they expect of him. I, I think, if I remember correctly, in my other Arsenal save, I paid like 16 million for him or something like that, um, which isn't too bad. But it's, it's obviously wow, he is not for sale at any price. We will see about that, right? Let's now just make an offer, uh, just to um, just to unsettle him, I guess, just to, so he knows um, that hey, we're we're here, we want you, and you've got to be coming to us. Um, training camp underway. Guy Tan to consider his options. There we go. Um, oh wow, he he he's possible move to Roma. That would be uh, quite quite annoying. Oh, so now they are willing to negotiate twenty four million. You have got to be dreaming. Um, I will give you guys sixteen and a half million and twenty percent of the next fee. Um, 
how do you add percentage of next sale and 20%. So, you know, that's that's not bad. That's not bad. It's around 20 million altogether. Uh, Coca Lane. Gold, gold. Is that on loan? Um, no, that's just a transfer offer. How old is Coca Lane? He looks pretty decent. 23. Uh, I don't know, man. I don't know if I want to let him go. He's okay. He'll be a decent backup player. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna reject that offer and see what happens with um, see what happens with my man Gaitan. And uh, I'm gonna build exact same team if I can for what I had before. Uh, oh wow, Quadrado is being offered. Obviously, Quadrado is, is insane on FIFA. He looks insane on here. Look at that as well. 18 dribbling. Decent first touch. Crazy good pace and stamina. Good agility and acceleration. But he's worth a lot. And I probably can't afford him. Um, let's scout him anyway and see uh, see what we're getting. So they've accepted the offer. Holy shit. I've been informed that Roma are monitoring the situation regarding the availability of my client. Here are my client's demands. So we can meet, we can meet all those demands. And... Um, 4.6 million signing on fee. Holy shit. Let's knock that down to a 3 mil and knock the agent's fee down to a 1.2 mil and suggest that. Damn, that's just that's so much. 4.3 million as a signing on fee. That's crazy. That is crazy. Well, I mean, let's just do it. I want him. So uh, I, I know he's good. I know he plays really, really well. And... Um, Oh wow, some some doubts may be worth tracking the player. Holy shit! Um, so uh, yeah, we we have signed Gaitan straight away. We've got Feyenoord now today. Uh, two more friendlies again in a little while. I don't know if we want to go uh, go too far. We won four three against Feyenoord. That's not bad. Aaron Ramsey with two and Arteta with one. And uh, has Martins with one goal. Aaron Ramsey looks so so good. He uh, he's like he's always been for the last like four or five years the guy with like the most potential in this game ever. Uh, it's crazy if you look at potential. Urz, Urz Ramsey yeah four star potential, but that will go up to five star. I just know it will because that's how this game goes, um, which is quite crazy. Um, once we get a guy tan, guys, I uh, don't know how long this. So this has been quite a short video already, actually only twelve minutes. So I will keep going through these friendlies. Maybe we'll try and get to the first BPL game. Um, before uh, before we get out of here. So backroom advice meeting. I do need to start working the tactics. Um, we'll start trainings. We can scout Spain. We don't need those. We don't need those. Uh, loan list, loan list, loan list. Uh, Zellalem definitely needs to go on loan. Uh, dismiss that. Concentrate on youth. Uh, okay. <laughs> Thanks for that. Thanks for that nugget of brilliance. The information there that I couldn't have done without. Um, and uh, here we go. So Coca Lane again. All right, let's try and uh, let's try and see if they want to pay pay for him. Let's. This is what I want. I want 1.8 million plus 40% uh, of next sale. There we go. We'll just we'll just throw it out there, um, just to see if they want to go for it or not. So uh, who else do I need to improve this squad? So I need a left back. Um, and in, again, in my last uh, in my last save, uh, we only won two one. Wow, I actually got Marcelo. Uh, and I was surprised that I picked up Marcelo as well. Um, let's go for let's go for Real Madrid. Oh damn! Oh damn! They don't really. Uh, anyway, where is Marcelo? There he is. He was he was really good for me, and then he got injured for like fucking ever. Um, Add to shortlist indefinitely. Um, he will be a key player in this squad. I don't, I don't know if that's actually done anything. What does that button do? Let's just move that up to there. Let's just do that. Um, yeah, so let, let's see if we can pick ourselves up Marcelo as well. Uh, Arsenal rise off to see the cherries, and um, Gaetan is coming. Marcelo target transfer target failure. What? Marcelo isn't interested in joining. That's uh, that's quite annoying. I do need a left back still. So uh, let me go for um, scouting. 
I need a first team player, left back, current and potential ability at four star. Yeah, that's okay. Um, well, I have 47 million available. That's not bad. That is not bad. Um, there we go. And let's go. Um, transfers. Joel Campbell, you've got no chance. No chance at all of taking Joel Campbell off me. He has got bags of potential. He can play in many positions. There is absolutely no way in hell that Joel Campbell is going anywhere. And we have signed Gaitan for 16 and a half million. Look at him. He looks brilliant. He just looks so good. Like the team that I had, honestly, guys, if I can replicate it, you'll be so impressed with uh, with how it goes. Um, uh, we don't want to accept that then. Go ahead, scouting report. We've got go ahead and then we've got Grimsby. Um, what do I see as his best position? Attacking midfielder on the left. There we go. Um, job done. It's just very easy. Squad win bonuses. Bang, bang, bang. That comes out of the transfer. Does that come out of the transfer budget? So Premier Division high, Continental high. Screw it. Let's just uh, let's put it all up there. Let's see. Let's see what they can do. Let's let's go and win everything. Let's just do it all. Um, so we have got go ahead right now. Let's see if we can pick up a win against them. The the friendlies have been going good so far. Uh, Schurler is there. Schurler would be nice, but once again, I just don't need him. I, I already have an abundance of wingers. I already signed Gaitan as well, and I definitely don't uh, definitely don't need another. Another player. Look at that finishing, man. 20 finishing. Absolutely beautiful. Lucas Podolski did uh, really good for me. Oh, wow. Hulk has been offered to me. For 38 million. Holy shit. Oh, he's good, though. He is good. I just don't need him. I just don't need that position to be filled. Like, there's just nothing there. I need a centre-back and a left-back. That's what I need. I need, def need defence. I need... Uh, I do need defence. Um, let's have a look at position. Can play centre back. So who's interested? Phil jo Phil Jones, please. Um, well, Phil Jones is supposedly the best. Oh wow, we could get Gary Cahill. Twenty-eight years old. He's obviously very good. Get Nastasic. Twenty-one years old. He's got good physicals there. Might be worth uh, might be worth giving him a little scout. Who else have we got around here? Marquinhos from PSG. Mm, not not overly keen on him. Sarko from Liverpool. I mean he's decent decent enough. Ignacio Martinez of Real Sociedad. See he's the sort of guy we could get for cheap because he is cheap. Let's um let's get a let's get a scout report on him as well. Obviously, he's injured for a while, which isn't good. Stephen Corker should be quite young and looks pretty decent as well. Mm, I think I'll, I don't, I'm not really interested. I like some of these guys because they could have potential five star. Uh, you know, they could potentially be those, those epic defenders. But I'll, I'll leave it for now. I've got, you know, I have got a few centre backs. I think I've got four centre backs: uh, Murtasaka, Koscielny. Um the club cannot currently afford the player. That's disappointing. Nastasic, we can't afford Nastasic. Um, he'd be very interested in joining. Okay, so let's um, let's add him as a transfer target. Let's let's see what happens. Hulk report. Hulk will possibly be getting four million to five million per month, and he would be a good signing. But like I said before, guys, we just don't need him. We just don't need him. He is fantastic, but we do not need him. And uh, we've got Grimsby in a week's time. What do you mean target failure? Let's uh Okay, so they didn't manage to get Ignacio Martinez. Let's uh let's see if we can get him for loan. Loan offer. They're not willing to loan him out. Okay, never mind then. We just won't we won't be getting him. Um Cockerlane. Oh damn, they've come back with a one point one. Let's let's put that back up to one point seven and uh, lock that in and negotiate that. Um I can't. I probably can't even afford anyone, really, can I? What's my transfer budget? Twenty-one million left. We've got. We could get De Bruyne. 
I, d I don't need to, like Luis Gustavo would be someone sick because he's got really good stats. He's good tackling. It'd be a really good DM for me. But once again, it's just someone that I I I just don't need. Like my midfield is just I just have so many players, so much. Like you know, it's, it's just not necessary. Um, when you look at the team, uh, central defenders. Yeah, see, I do have I could play Debushi at centre back as well. Um, so Koscielny and Murtasaka at, at left back. We're going to have Kieran Gibbs. The central midfielders are going to be Aaron Ramsey. Why is Flamini listed? Flamini is sick. He's such a good player. Why would why why have we what no transfer transfer status? He is back up. He is not listed. I do not want to get rid of Matthew Flamini. He is uh, very important to this club. Not that I want him in the team, mind, um, because we will be having Jack Wilshere and Aaron Ramsey, and then uh, I guess it doesn't really like mess with Ozil. But we're going to play Ozil up here, not there. We're going to play Ozil there. We're going to play these guys here, and this is going to be so attacking. But fucking YOLO. This, like I said, this is the formation I had um, before. This is what we're going to do again. So on the right, we want Sanchez. On the left, um, I guess Gaetan is going to be my guy. No, no place in the squad for Santi Cazorla. Um, and then up front, we've got Danny Welbeck. So uh, once Walcott is out for such a long time, he will eventually uh, he will eventually come back. So here we go again. So I want um, we do want him to be a winger, but an attacking winger, and we want Sanchez to be an attacking winger as well. We want him to be support. So we want a uh, a defensive midfielder in Ramsey. Not that I think Ramsey should be a defence midfielder, but we don't really have any good DMs. And uh, for Jack Wilshere, we'll have him supporting. I'm okay with that. Like that team, it should be good. Um, I want to play control and fluid, and we do want to retain possession. We do want to run at the defence because we're good enough to do so, and I do want to look for the overlap. Uh, because I like Debushi and Gibbs to get forwards. Uh, let's play at a higher tempo as well. So these players, they, they're they good enough to, to deal with this. The team is good. This That will be my starting lineup. Um, obviously, I will ro have to rotate a lot of players because they get they get tired, they get injured, and uh, obviously someone like Santi Cazorla just sitting on the bench is uh, no bueno. And o Oxay chamberlain as well, um, he, he's good. He is very good. Uh, 20 years old, a lot of potential. But anyway, we got uh, Grimsby, and we got two more friendlies. Um, what we got going on here? What? How long have we been recording for? 22 minutes. So I think we're close to. Um, let's offer Abu Diab because Abu Diab, he's old. He's well, not old, but 28. Mm, yeah, I, I don't really care if he's. Uh, let's offer him a new contract just so I can sell him. Um, just, just so that he will be like he's worth nine million. If I, you know, if I get a new contract for him he's going to be worth nine million maybe i'll play him for you know a, a couple of months and then sell him on which would be sick we've got wellington silver as well 21 years old again he looks pretty decent he just uh i don't know man we've got cocker lane mm. oh shit mario gomez has got bags of potential i don't need strikers i don't need i don't i need defenders and only defenders all uh, right let's speak to joel campbell there are rumours floating around that AS Monaco are interested in me and I'd like your permission to talk to them. If a bid comes in, I think they would consider me more important to their squad than you do and that is something I'm very advantage, uh, very keen to take advantage of. Um, I, I want, like, I I think he's going to be valuable to us. Uh, here we go. Um, I want to be important. The most important player in the side. I'd be happy to say if you could show me that I'd be considered as a key player here. Um, the, the, like the two options that you have are, are really like really shit because it's like yes, you're going to be a key player, or excuse me, I'm the fucking manager. Who do you think you are? Like I want to be able to say to him, you're not a key player at the moment, but you're young, and I really want you in my team. Like. You will be the sort of player that in two, three, four years, you'll be massive to the club. Um, so I'm just going to have to say that he's a key player and kind of play him a lot more than I really want to. Um, 
Uh, let's set squad status to... See, he wants to be key player. That's outrageous. That's genuinely outrageous that he thinks he is a key player. That's crazy. So when have we got our first game? Our first game isn't until the 10th, um, which is quite a way away. Uh, we have been recording for 25 minutes. So I don't want this video to be too long. So we'll do the rest of preseason in the next episode, guys. For now, I'm just going to save it. Um, let's just respond to this auto select. Uh, yeah, for now, I'm just going to save the game. Um, and move on to uh, the next video for tomorrow, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this. If there's anything, again, that you guys see me doing categorically wrong, just let me know in the comment section below. But thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this. And I will see you next time. I'm out. Peace.